I'm turning it, but it ain't it ain't doing it. Oh, there it goes. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, that's creepy. Speed it up. <laughs> it's the chipmunk sound uh, track. Hello everyone, this is Valhalla Gaming TV, and this is the channel that plays everything so you don't have to. Today we are playing Layers of Fear. This is part two of the series. If you guys haven't seen the previous part, I'll leave a link up on the top right of the screen so you can click it. Alright, let's get into it. All right, let's see what's in here. Oh, we got an elevator. Oh, I love elevators. I'm, I'm sure we're going down into hell. Uh, which way is up? No, nope. can I go this way? No, nope. guess we're going that way. Oh, we got to we got to shut that. OK, put that back. Got to make sure it's shut. We need safety here. And kaboom. Oh, we're going up. Thank God. Thank God. I hate going down. It's only up from here, people. We're already at the bottom. What is going on? Okay. Okay. We're in like a fun house. Pass catches on. What do you mean by that? Anybody home? All right, we're here. Where is here? I have no idea. This is a massive house, though. It's got an elevator. Can I open this? Nope, locked. Oh, that's a nice vase. Look at that. That's pretty. Nothing in there. You're locked. You're locked. Okay, one door left. Oh, I thought I heard something. No, nope, that's locked. I did hear something. That door opened. Okay. That's where it wants me to go. Oh, it's that creepy painting. Furry face. And a creepy closet is this. Got a key. Dear sir, while I can certainly understand that you are upset and I have nothing but sympathy for you or for your wife and yourself, I must categorically state that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure. Having stated that, I assure you that me and my colleagues at St. Anne have made every effort to ensure a positive outcome for your wife. Personally speaking, I believe we have done the best job possible considering the extent of tissue damage. You are, of course, entitled to your opinion, and I can certainly understand your disappointment. What I do not understand is how you seem to think writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will... What is that word? Ameliorate? Or ameliorate? The situation? As I've already stated, I can certainly understand you've been under a lot of stress as of late. And thus, I will not press charges if you retain from any future correspondence. Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information for several specialists who would be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regards and best wishes for you and your wife, William H. Green, MD. And this guy's just causing problems for everybody. All right, let's go out of here. We got a key now. Ooh. What's going on here? That must be his wife's song. Why did you stop? That tune was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Oh, don't make me beg. Oh, it's burning. That's not good. What's happening, man? Painting's all messed up. Okay, we're going this way. You don't got the key for that. I guess it was this one. That elevator looks lower, too. 
Hello? Door shut. Got ourselves some books. Everywhere you go around here is a, a staircase to the attic. Oh. I hear fire. Okay, that's locked. It looks like we're going up. I was complaining about going down, but I guess we're just going to keep going up. Why is there a fire in here? Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Who's burning? Okay. Okay, let's try to get over here. He'll be burning the house down. Hello? I think it's coming from that case. Oh, God. E. Why did that remind me of Death Stranding for some reason? Okay, baby is melted. Let's see where we're going from here. Hallway after hallway. Where do we go now? That looks nice. It's like a goat man. Make up your mind. All right. Got to figure out where we're going. Another letter. The following list is a compilation of the most common symptoms of schizophrenia. While the typical are typically diagnosed between the ages of 15 and 25, the disorder is known to affect older patients as well. Note that these symptoms are not exclusive to schizophrenia and should by no means be treated as a conclusive evidence of the particular affliction. In order to obtain a proper diagnosis, you should contact a qualified specialist, i.e. a psychologist or psychiatrist. Blank expression, stares, off into space, yes. Involuntary facial movements, yes. Insomnia, haven't noticed. Unusual gestures or postures, always had that. Unable to experience joy from activities, definitely. Depersonalization, what does that even mean? Awkward, clumsy movements, might be from the accident. Prone to anger or resentment, more passive aggressive. Lack of motivation, yes. Suicidal tendencies, what kind of question is that? All right. So they're getting a psych evaluation and there's some more traps. Anything here? More books. Books over here. Oh, another rat. He just went right by the trap. Like it was nothing. Yeah, they're working real good. I guess we're going this way. Anything over here? Nothing. Just books. The amount of books in this freaking place, man. Okay. There's that elk, but it doesn't have the doll on it anymore. Nothing in there. And that's a weird one over there. Look at that painting. Man, that's like some Attack on Titan stuff right there. Uh, more alcohol. Anything in here? Bunch of war medals. Don't see nothing down there. All right, where are we going? Where are we going? Wherever it stops, that's where we're traveling. Oh, come on, big money, big money, big money. No whammy. And we are going. Where are we going? Oh. Oh. Okay. That is near Egypt, I think. Tell me where that is. That's where we're going. Somewhere in uh, it's North Africa, left of India, right of Europe. Okay, I don't know. Geography me in the comments. Tell me out. Where are we going? All right, let's go through this door. Oh God. What the hell? 
Okay. 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 That painting flew across the place and somehow something popped up here. A safe. Alright, we need to find a combination apparently. Alright. Take it easy now. For some numbers. Why did that painting fly all the way over here? You can't open none of this? Do you see any numbers around this place? Because I don't see nothing. Any piece of paper? This whole place has got demolished in half a second. Okay, let's look around. We got some doors here. Okay, that opens up. Does this one? Good thing that one doesn't. Let's make a noise. I don't like it. Was there a ch- Yep, we can open this. Nope, nothing. Alright, we're looking for numbers. Are you telling a number clock? What do we got in here? Nothing. Why is the light blinking? Okay, what's it doing? Numbers? Why is it all burnt? Something changed. It was that painting, but something else changed. Okay, let's look through these. Bottom one. Got some clothes. Rope. Can't have enough rope. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, there's stuff here. It's backwards. And where are we going? Did we go through the mirror? This clearly is backwards if we want to read it. Oh, it's a portal. Okay. Okay, we turn around now. Oh, God. It cannot be undone. Oh, what is going on in there? I can't go back through. Man, what is happening in this game? Is there any- okay, there's a note. Can't do nothing with that. There's that cool vase again. Why does this hallway look so weird? Doggo! It's the hunt. Oh god. Oh, dog's dead. He got burnt. Barbecue doggo. What do we got over here? Oh, I didn't look behind me. I'm hearing all sorts of weird noises, man. Good boy. Oh, there's the collar. Okay. Look over here real quick. The collar is the item. All right, grab it. Honey, remember how you said it would be nice to have a cat so the baby could have someone to play with? Well, I just bought us a dog. <laughs> huh. What a nice guy. I want to have a cat. Well, I got you the next best thing. A dog. A barbecue dog at that. I like both cats and dogs, but I think I'd prefer dogs. And here we go. All right, we're in another room here. You want this as well? Want what? There's something over here? Okay. I like to get a number for that safe combination. What's this? A once great artist, Blank's new painting launched out of galleries. What we witnessed today, while entirely worthless in artistic terms, might be an invaluable case study for a psychologi or psychologist. These harsh words came from none other than Jason Hughes. The famed critic was one of the first to appreciate the works of Blank, and whose praise once contributed to his first spectacular success, when asked if such brutal criticism was indeed called for, especially in light of the recent tragic events, Hughes responded, As critics, it is our duty to critique art, but not to judge the artist. The man has been through a lot lately, and obviously it has taken a toll on him. Still, if we were to remain silent and pretend this is even remotely acceptable, we would be doing the artist a disservice. 
Other critics were only slightly more lenient. As Blink. Okay. So I guess he's going downhill. He used to be a really good artist and his drinking problem and it, sound, it seems like he's going crazy too, so. Hello? Is there something behind me that changed? Oh god. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> something definitely changed behind me. Okay. Alright, wheelchairs. What do we got in here? Long hallway. What's in here? Lock. That's locked as well. Like we're not going to those. We're gonna hobble down here. I'm not gonna look behind me no more. Okay, 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 okay. What is that? What the? F it's a big picture to a small picture. To oh god. <laughs> <sighs> nope, doesn't open up. Oh, gosh, dang rats, man. It's getting scary now. Pictures got small. What, the wheelchair is going on in the floor over there? What the heck? Okay, that opens up. Before we go down there, does this one too? Which one do we take? Paintings or the wheelchair? What about down here? All the paintings are so small now. Oh god. Okay, I guess we gotta make a choice. The wheelchair, so the wife or the paintings? Are we going to be selfish? Or are we going for the wife? And... Okay, let's go for the wife. I'm a helpless romantic. I made a mistake. Okay, we're gonna go for the painting, man. I, oh god, no. Okay. Alright. Big boy pants. We gotta fix things in the old relationship front. September 12th. She's been at it again. Earlier in the day, I found more of her reviews. Little notes stuck to one of my latest paintings. Some of the most scathing, hateful shit I've ever read in, about my work. I guess I shouldn't be surprised after all. She knows me well enough to know what really gets to me. I just can't believe she would use that against me. Worst thing is, when I confronted her about it, she claimed she hadn't written any of them. Like I can't tell her handwriting, Jesus. Does she really hate me that much, or is her mind starting to slip? I just don't know what to do anymore. So, isn't she supposed to be like schizophrenic or something? Maybe that was after she had her baby and her mind snapped? Either way, this, is, this seems pretty messed up. Oh! Whoa. Oh my god, that's my number one fan. I didn't do nothing to you, did I? Oh god. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Red vase again. I haven't found any numbers yet. Oh. Something changed. Oh. What's going on with that? Okay, give me a second. Let me look around first. Door wants me to go in there. The house is alive, man. Can I open this up here? It's a cupboard that I... Okay, I guess I'm going into the creepy door that just opened for me. Oh. Chill out. I'm coming in, man. Anything in here? Oh, okay. does the light work? Candles. That's old school light. Okay. Nothing of note. More candles. Got a bed. What's this? Key. Oh, light the candles. I don't know what for. Oh, what's going on? Light the candles. Something's opening, man. Light those candles. Dude, there's something moving. 
Is it coming to the door? Oh, it's trying to open the door. Who is it? Housekeeping. Nobody's here, man. Take a powder. Ooh, this room's changing. Is it leaving? Oh my god, look at that. You can smell your feet. But take a shower. Okay, I can't open that yet. Probably a good thing. Now I can. Ew. I left a slug trail. Just went into the painting. Alright, I'll go this way, you go home, okay? I'm, I'm not doing... Alright. What's that? Unleash your inner beauty with a new Glamour Fusion Max. Say farewell to acne scars, enlarged pores, and other unpleasant skin conditions. The new Glamour Fusion Max Concealer will give your skin a healthier look and a smoother feel. Don't think of it as covering up your de uh, deficiencies. Think of it as unleashing your inner beauty. <laughs> my, 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 my teacher said that beauty comes from the inside. Well, that's just some ugly people say. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Let's get out of here. Like, oh, oh God, we're back here. Hey, what's in here? One of those items is around here. Where's that? Honey, what in the world are you doing? What did the doctor say about straining yourself? Leave that thing alone. It's not going anywhere. Gotta get rid of her Stradivarius. Ooh, things are changing. That door hasn't shut. That's new. Open. That's where that ring was last time, and this wasn't... This was broke last time. Can I do something with this? Oh, I can crank it. And there's the... Okay. Before we do that, let's look around. Man, did anybody ever think about bringing a level? Look how unstraightened that is. And the whole house is all warped. What's over here? Oh, okay. So that makes it go forward and back, I think. Can we crank it? Okay, we're definitely going to need the record. Crank it. What is going on? The whole place is melting. Switch it. Oh, it's... It's going back. It's fixing itself. Are we supposed to make it all nasty? Can I open that? No, we were there before. I think we have to make it all nasty. Okay. Make it the creepy backwards music. Oh, uh, crank it. How do we do it? We went just fine last time. There it goes. Oh man, this is messed up. So you're gonna break? This is my tune right here, though. It's kind of my jam. Well, what is that? I needed a jar and a plastic tubing. I siphoned gas before. I knew how it was done. I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth. Then put the tube in the jar and it just kept coming. A taste of copper haunted me the entire night. Why didn't I think of a syringe? Yeah, that would have been a better idea. But why do you need the blood? Man, again, this is like some Van Gogh stuff. I hope I'm uh, 
you know, referencing the right artist, but I do remember somebody that used to have their, like, got their ear cut off or something, or bit it off. No, never mind, cut off. Okay, so I got that. I think I can turn it back. I think that's what we gotta do. And I think we go left with it. Nope. Which way does it go? Doesn't want to go that way. What's this? Oh, is that to speed it up? I'm turning it, but it ain't it ain't doing it. Oh, there it goes. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, that's creepy. Speed it up. <laughs> it's the chipmunk sound uh, track. Okay, well, we got that blood stuff, so I think we can get out of here. Oh, yep, we're back. Oh, there's something over here. Oh, stop looking at me like that. It's just a little something to help me focus on my work. That's all. That's all. That liquid courage. What's it going to do now? Went from flamingos to... Uh, what is that? That looks like, like a wolf's head or something. And like... Okay, I'm just gonna say it's a wolf's head with a goose coming out of its body. Yeah, we're going with that. Oh, look at that. Look at that. We got two of them. Okay, so there's gonna be a total of six. Eight even now, lost alone. You deserve it. A grave for you. Finish it. It's getting further. All right, everyone, you made it to the end of part two of Layers of Fear. This is uh, not going to be the end of the series. We're going to keep it going and finish the game to the end. Next one is going to be episode three. If you made it this far and you like the content, go and hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you can see the stuff popping up. And also hit that like button so we can get this uh, community we got here built bigger. All right, everyone. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Later.